damn it, I thought I was ready. Okay. What are we doing? We're playing a game. Yeah, we're playing we're playing Journey. So we're um, walking into this. Well, you're playing Journey. I'm eating potato chips. No, you're playing Journey. Okay. This one's this one's on you. You're you're playing the What? Game. Yeah, you're playing. I no. Yes. No. Yeah, you can no. do it. Okay. So what's your apprehension here? Um, I'm bad at video games. <laughs> <laughs> I'm extremely bad at video games, even no. though I really like them. No, 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 no. You're playing this one. I'm you, still bad I, at them. No, 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 no. You can play this one. Trust me. Trust me on this. You can a hundred percent play this game. This is uh this is developed by that game company. They are a company that you might be familiar with or might not be. They make um they're far more interested in storytelling and conveying an emotional experience than they are in really testing your reflexes and coordination. So this is going to be primarily exploration and puzzle solving. It's not going to really bring the hammer down on your ability to use your hands, which, you know... One of them does not work. Yeah, um, big, uh, for reasons. <laughs> mm, I my apprehension at video games. Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, so that's that's exactly why you'll be playing this. And besides that, like if as you can kind of see, right? Um, I had uh, oh yeah, sorry. Um, I've already got a hundred percent on this game. Yeah, close Sonic Forces. That was just a, our testy testicles. Um, there but we go. I, I pushed it. Did you? I did. Okay. Um, yes. Yeah, I mean, so, so this will be more like visual novel style. Like a little bit, it's um, it's it's more kind of um, wandry. It's like a, it's like an episode of Samurai Jack. It's just oh no, two hours of walking. No, um, no, it's I it's don't actually like that show. It's a lot more um, it's it's fascinating. I don't don't even know how to describe this really. Like it's it's a learning experience. It's, well, I've only uh, ever heard good things, so yeah, yeah. So um, expectations walking into this. What uh, what do you think it's about? What do you think happens? I have no idea. Fantastic. I have no expectations other than I've heard this game is good. All right. So I expect it to be good. Excellent. Um, All right, we're going on a new journey. Exactly. So there is uh, before we get too far in, there will be an option available to us where you'll be able to pick um, going this the natural way and having a slightly easier time of it. And I'll point out where you're able to switch that option. Okay. Anytime there's a secret that I remember, I'll help sort of gently guide you towards it. But for the most part, I want to see you explore and learn about this landscape. Okay. You're like really daunting me right now am i like i i i feel daunted i do I, is, is that a, a word like it, am no, i using no. that right i it's, don't feel like i am you're absolutely correct that's a completely uh fair it's a good scrabble word yeah. daunted if you end up with a <laughs> so is ojime ah fuck ojime <laughs> ojime can drink a dick <laughs> a carved bead used as a class Whoa. <laughs> There you go. I've taught you all a new word. Yeah. <laughs> new words are great. And also... Oh, uh, look at you. You're adorable. I'm I'm new pretty word. sure I'm one of those... What are they called? The sand creatures from Star Wars? <laughs> <laughs> no. The Tusken Raiders are far more hardcore and weird. This is... You know, these are... You know, you're a pretty robed uh roby person with I am indeed wearing a robe. Yeah. And the Okay, what am I looking at? And you're also oh. a cat, I think. Ah. Cuz you've got the little pointy head. I'm much taller than I appeared to be. Yeah, you were sitting down. There you go. Woo! Wee! Yay! I'm running. I'm running across sand. Aren't the sand effects fucking spectacular? It is a very pretty game. It is. It's a gorgeous game. Oh, this is bringing me back to really special times. This is bringing me back to college. <laughs> really? No. Did you see somebody playing this? No, no, no. Uh, because of the nature of the program that I was in. Oh, yeah. I know how to make this. So tell the folks at home, you you kind of actually know how to make one of these. So I wasn't actually in the video game design program. Um, that was an entirely different program, but stop, we worked... Stop. What? Stump, Am I stomping stump, these stump. things? Yeah, trudge, 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 trudge. Uh, yeah, and there's our title card. 
Whoa. Oh, isn't that just cinematically the coolest thing ever? I, again, I know how to make that. Yes! <laughs> so you were very much the, the uh, forefront of um, how to make the visual and asset aspects of all this. Yes, yeah, so I know how to make assets and I know like obviously like unwrapping and lighting are my favorite things to do, which is good because not a lot of people like doing those things. Yeah, it, it puts you in a in sort of a um, a career niche where like it, you're mm. kind of the most useful person in the room mm. if all you're surrounded by is mm. programmers. Mm. Yeah, because programmers um, actually know how to put together the game, right, and to make it and stuff. But I know how to make the assets. Yeah, but I mean you, texture you, them and exactly. light them and yeah. Because it's um, there's a, a a big sort of divide in gaming that's a slide. Do I? Oh, it's my need favorite. Need any game of game. this stuff behind me? No, not at all. No. Okay, I'm gonna um, keep twirling. Like ninety percent of the game is scenery, but it's scenery that teaches you the story of this world. Um, okay, so what what yeah. uh, are these? Are these graves? Yes. Am I in a grave? <gasps> it's a, the sandiest graveyard. You begin. Okay, on... so everyone's dead. Yes. Yeah, it's... Um... I've entered a Mad Max situation. Yeah, no, this is actually an indirect sequel to Trigun. Is it really? No. No. <laughs> I get so excited for a second. <laughs> I'm sorry. But it's, um, you know, you get this uh, this sprawling desert planet with all, like, most There's people are people dead. There's people buried in here? An entire civilization is buried. Okay, but by who? If everyone died, who buried them? Ooh, good question. Who did the cleanup for this whole dead civilization? What is this? These are these are my favorite guys. I love them. They're oh. they're swimmies. Uh, I am surrounded by. Yep. Yeah, you just. I don't want to say it. So you're surrounded. Oh God, is that where you're going with that? Ooh. I mean, you did say swimmies. Yeah. No, they're swimmies. They're your friends. And they just gave you a scarf. It's like that episode of Doctor Who with the flying fish. I don't know why I'm reminded of that episode so much these days. It's because it's an Ooh. awesome episode. Yeah, now you can jump and you can jump and fly and they give you your scarf back when you run out of it. Wait, I can run out of my scarf? That's yeah. unfortunate. So you see the runes that glow on your scarf. That is your ability to jump and fly. So um, without them, you can't move upwards Meow. um <laughs> you said i'm yeah. a cat person yeah you're a cat Ooh. you're clearly a cat look at your little pointy head um so as long as you have runes on your scarf you can uh fly about like an aerial ballerina and the swimmies give you your flight back when you run out of it okay but like do they come to wherever i am no you have or to go over to that i have them. to go back no you, there's more over over to your left explorers have a, a little bit of a hustle over here see Ooh. so there's periodically there's loads of these guys just around so that you can do your jumping and flying and exploring and they'll help you just get your energy back how about if i just want to stand here and be surrounded by these Fishy things. Then they will swim around you forever because they love you. And I'm just I'm gonna stand in place. Yeah. No, I'm I'm gonna explore. Okay. Let's explore. Yeah. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> I am terrible with a controller. That's dubs. that is okay. That's absolutely fine. Um, you're not going to need to be speedy or proficient in any regard. Um, uh, see how I keep like a... turning the wrong way. Like, I meant to go this way, and then I went this way. That's okay. That's all right. <laughs> Keyboard and mouse just makes so much more sense. Um, I'm completely lost right now. That's so okay. I don't know what where I'm going. Follow the graves. But Brian. Yeah. They're fucking everywhere. Yeah, but if you can kind of tell, there's sort of a path of them. Like, a little bit. So head, head a, bit, a bit that way. And then there's some shit over there, and then there's some shit over there. But I mean, I can see the swimmy thing. Yeah. See, I'm doing it again. And like buildings way in the distance and stuff. Oh, yeah. There's that thing up yeah. ahead there. Yeah. So there's the big Colosseum. Uh, you don't need to go there yet. Um, but what if I want to? Well, you can. All right. There's just other stuff to check out. Oh. <laughs> well, then I'm going this way, aren't there's I? <laughs> uh. 
sorry. You that can see me like struggling through the stand dunes too. Yeah, no, it's especially if you're going like nearly vertical, your your character will have a lot of difficulty uh, maneuvering around the terrain. And um, if you that's I, really cool. Yeah, that's like a l different level of detail. Oh, the detail is my favorite part of this. They really, they really went for it. Um, yeah, you've got. Uh, What's this? It's. What's this? I can't believe my eyes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Some nightmare before Rosh Hashanah shenanigans here. Ooh, Ooh. spooky. Yeah. So, uh, go go right up to that, the so, big so TV screen. There's a TV screen. Yeah, let's uh, approach it over eh. here. Eh. Eh. Yeah. My hand is struggling so hard. Oh dear. Uh, this? Okay. Yeah. Oh. Right on up and. What? Yeah. What? What did? What just happened? That's. What did I just do? So the community refers to that as as singing or chirping. Um. um basically, you've got your little note, and that helps illuminate uh, the past. And okay. this is. So what are we looking at here? So this is uh, this is the method of storytelling in this game. It's sort of a, a hieroglyph-esque um, sort of picture storytelling. Okay, but they all look the same. Yes, but who it, do, uh, who what do they look the same as? Well, those tall things are, are clearly gravestones. So everyone's dead. Yeah, and the little that's all this hieroglyph tells me. And that's like a hundred sideways versions of little things that look like you. <gasps> oh no! Yeah. Am I the last one left? You might be. That's... Uh, I'm not giving you spoilers. Yeah, no. Yeah. This is why I hate doing anything with you. <laughs> <laughs> because because I, you don't give me anything. I don't give you spoilers. I want you to learn the story for yourself. I can't go any and further up this. No, there's there's no up. Oh. It's, it's bullshit. It's just yeah. rude. Oh, are you stuck? Oh! No. I was I was trying to go the, the same way. Honestly, sliding around. There's a couple levels in this game where you can uh, just slide ah, around places. Did not mean to do that. Whoops. Um, that's okay. And uh, it's one of my favorite things to do. Sprinkling fishies around. Um, uh, okay, so. Yeah. Was that all there was to that temple? That's all there was to that temple. Now you can head in any direction you like and be, rest very well assured that you've checked out that specific temple. That's all I had to do? <laughs> That's all you had to do okay, well, in I'm that going, particular temple. I'm going this way now where there is nothingness but Excellent. sand dunes. Excellent. Perfect. Uh, you're bound to run into Luke Skywalker at some point. At some point, yes. Tell him he owes you money. Why does he owe me money? Uh, he owes everybody money. That's fair. <laughs> Although he does technically Ooh, have getting, a, a rich father. Getting windy. Eh, oh no. Oh no. I don't know if Darth Vader's like rich per se or if he just doesn't have to pay for shit for himself. Ah. Ooh, Woo! yeah. Cool. Yeah. Wait, wait a second. Yeah, you went back the way you came a little bit. Uh, yeah, that's that same temple, isn't it? Mm-hmm. But from the other side. Oh, I'm behind it now. Yeah. No, why Why does it keep changing? Like, it keeps it's, painting by itself. I'm not even touching it right now. Yeah, it's a little bit trying to discourage you from going too far in that direction. Why? That is how they barrier a completely open world. Then why did you tell me I could go anywhere I wanted? Well, I kind of wanted you I to... I feel lied to. I kind of wanted you to run into the wind wall and discover that. You just that. wanted to see me slide around. Well, see, I, I want to see you slide around, but I also was kind of hoping that you'd manage to struggle your way forward far enough that it, the wind actually knocks you over and sends you spiraling backwards a bit. Oh! Yeah, the they really force you well, back see, if you if go you too far. See, if you hadn't told me that mm. that was the boundary, I, that's what I would have done. You would have eventually. I would have just kept going. <laughs> All it's right, still panning that? by itself. Yeah, I think it, it, to an extent, as you move, the camera sort of points you very gently in the I'm direction. The king of the world. In the direction it figures you should be moving. Okay. Um, so where does it think I should be going? Uh, to the right, broadly speaking. There we go. That's broadly speaking. Oh. Majestic Colosseum way over there in the background. Yep. 
and more swimmethies. Yay! See how they glow a little bit as well when they come over? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so graves, graves, graves. Yep. Toby Hargraves. What? Uh, never mind. He's a comedian that I really like. Uh, isn't that the last name of the kids from the Umbrella Academy? No. Uh, Hargrave? Hard. Yeah. I don't know. I don't Hargrave? remember shit about that Hargrave? show. Hargrave? No. Except for Klaus, because he's the only reason to watch that. I mean, he's pretty great. Uh, oh. What oh, the, the heck you've is got this? some. You got some guys trapped in there. Can you save them? Can I? I don't know. I don't remember. Are they ah, actually trapped under the there forever? What the heck is it doing? Oh no. Yeah, now I remember. There is actually a puzzle in this area. Um, and you can free a few guys. Interesting. I think. It's been like three years Go since I played this. Go find the puzzle. Yeah. Well, there's swimming guys over here. So they've obviously gotten free. Oh, it lifts up. I see. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, this is a little central pillory uh, caterpillar. So we're going into this settlement here. Yeah, you um you can. So do you want me to tell you what all this is? Like um, this? I assume that this is where the cat people lived. Um, yes, lore wise. I I meant uh, game functionality. Oh, that's not nearly as fun. <laughs> No, in my opinion, no, but uh, I kind of figured it's worth knowing what this little zone actually is. What's that um, glowy thing in the distance? Oh, that is uh, that is a hieroglyph. You get a, you get a couple of them uh, right here. Can they, I go see it? Yes, you can go see it. You can go collect it. Okay, I will do that later. Okay. I'm over here right now. You can go collect those, and they uh, <laughs> they help you along on your journey. <laughs> What? Uh, <laughs> there's a wall there. Yeah, there is a wall there. Okay. Can you? I'm trying to. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to pan. You're trying to. <laughs> I'm just having oh, a really oh no. hard time. <laughs> Told you I'm no good with the control. Give me a keyboard and mouse. Uh, I will fall if I go any further. Well, probably yes, but that. Should I do it? Y yeah. Whee! Ooh, I can fly! Yeah, you can cool. glide. You glide and just gently land anywhere you go. I really am a cat. Yeah, well, cool. you're, you're a cat made out of swimmies. I'm made out of those things? Yeah, you're the same type of thing that those are made out of. Uh, so all... Paper? All The whole ecosystem of this world is made up of this, this weird sort of papery, clothy kind of stuff. I don't, am you, I on you can't the ledge? Quite, yeah, you can't quite get up the ledge. Um, oh. I think you might have to go around. Well, I can't. Oh, no, you've gotten up it a little bit there, but. And I'm gonna fall. Oh, uh. Nice. That wasn't bad. Was I supposed to be able to do that? Yeah, well, I, I don't know. I've, I've <laughs> uh, always had a jump <laughs> at that point. <laughs> Yay! Wait, what the heck Here's, just. What yeah, just happened? You made friends with some more Wigglies. What? I'm absorbing the... You're absorbing, like, magic wigglies. from them. No, I'm, and I'm then absorbing them. Those two are it, gone. It shot into the floor. Oh. It, it retreated well, into the floor. that's not nearly as fun. It went... What am I... Uh, I'm shaking. Oh. Why am I shaking? <gasps> yeah! Oh, there's so many of them. I let them free. Hooray! You can thank me in the liner notes. In the what? The liner notes. The liner notes? <laughs> yeah. I, I'm not sure what you're talking about. <laughs> um, CDs. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, the little, like, insert in the CD. Oh, where yeah. they do, like, this special thanks and the lyrics and shit? Yeah. Okay. Are these things following me now? Yeah, they're happy to see you. Um, will they be following me for long? No. Okay. No, they, they mostly have a patrol route that's like this top of this surface, and then they just kind of, yeah, see, they've migrated towards the center, and now they detect you, and they come over. Huh. Yeah. They're like cats. So if you want to get the hieroglyph, it's just to your left. Um, oh, is it? Yeah, down down uh, just over that ledge. Um, 
It's here over, I over here. Oh, Whee! way too far. Way oh. too far. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> well. Oh, I good heavens. that up. Eh. But, uh, oh, it's yeah. over there. Yeah, see, okay. it's up there. Um, so you just follow the spiral along, um, or try and jump up from about here. No, you used up your thing. That's fine. <laughs> Oh, you're right. I think I will have to go around. Yeah. Um, you can go up top and then collect more more swim. And then come back down and uh, well, back down the collapsed bit. Yeah. Eh. 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 So even... Okay. You're but sort of... I collect it. Yeah. I got it. That's why I'm going. Okay. Yeah. Excellent. All right. Um, no. I'm going the wrong way. This yeah. is fine. This is fine. Whee! So what is this? Um, that is. That's the hieroglyph. Yeah. Oh, I found it. So that's all yours now. Okay, what was it? Well, you see how your <laughs> scarf is longer now. Is it? Yeah. I can't tell. Your scarf is longer oh, now. Oh, it is longer. It's longer, and you can jump more. A little, uh, little bit more. That was just a pretty a, fantastic landing, though. Just a scrid. Oh yes, yeah, so you did a superhero landing from I did. about three and a half feet up. Thick up. <laughs> Way to ruin my fun, Brian. <laughs> I like one of those people that like <laughs> that like go stop it when I'm like at the movie theater watching a 3D movie and I'm like, ooh, 3D. <laughs> I, Only... I actually I've had someone knock my hand down and be like, stop it. Oh man, <laughs> no, because I'm I'm doing exactly the same thing. A 3D movie comes on and they put so they put the goggles on and they have things swimming across the screen and you're like, oh, with the wiggly arms, and yeah, I'm right there with you. I'm doing it too. <laughs> so how do I get up here? I think uh, the shallower, yeah, I'd say approach from the shallower yeah. side and then jump at it. Yeah. You've read my mind. Okay. And jump. Yeah, jump just a little here. bit of point. Whoa. Whoa. No, this way. Oh, no. oh, you know what? You got it. it yeah. I did. Oh, good. Okay. You, you, yeah, you swam into its detection range, I guess, and then it decided, oh, close enough. Fuck yeah. it. <laughs> Area of effect. So there's like, uh, I think there's 24 or 26 of those. Some uh, of them, uh, some of them are really hard to get, so don't worry uh, about it. Just uh, get through the story as best you can, and it won't really matter. Okay, but I'm, I'm just wandering around ruins now. Like, yeah. R ruins. Sorry. Yeah. Ru ru ruins. Ru ru ruins. There, so some of the ruins have ruins on them. Okay. Okay. No. Now there is something uh, over to your left a, ba a ways. So you remember how there's sort of a difficulty setting um, that I told you about? It's better be on easy. <laughs> okay, a little bit Hi, to your Gizmo. right. Hey, Gizmo's here. Gizmo's been here for a while. Perfect. Okay, a little bit to the right. A little, mm, bit, to little the right. bit to the right. Further to the right. Ah, I fell. That's okay. I, I skidded down that hill. Okay, so you're wanna, gonna wanna go kinda in a general kinda this way direction. Uh, okay. And then I'll, uh. I'll kinda show you what uh, what this side of the ruin is all about. Um, like, yeah, apparently these are just actually broken. There's, uh, they're just stuck in there. Aww. Oh boy. That makes me kind of sad. Yeah, because this one, like, the top can't lift up. It can't lift stand. out. It is. Yeah, it's it's broken. Um, but, like, why don't they... They're paper. Why don't they swim out the hole? Yeah, just roll themselves up and come up through these little... Exactly. I don't think they're smart. They're they're very well-meaning and they're very <sighs> pleasant, but they're not, they're not clever. <laughs> they, they seem very friendly. They are friendly. Oh, they're your best friends. Are they? Yes. Okay, uh, I think you've gone a little bit... Um, Too far? Yeah, maybe to the... Look to the left. Okay, that. Oh, up there. That thing? Yeah, the sort of jellyfish wiggling its little legs in the air thing. It looks like something I would encounter in Subnautica. Oh, yeah? Um, uh, I, haven't, I haven't played that. I haven't played too much of it yet, but my little brother's, like, obsessed with it. Wee. Okay, so um, this is Ooh! an unlockable. Yeah. It, it's red now. Yeah, and now you're red again. And now it's red and you're white. And I am glowing, yes. it's white and you're red. Okay, uh, you'll want to you step off of it at some point. Why? 
because now you're just changing costumes over and over again. <laughs> and as much as I appreciate you being fabulous and magical, um, I am usually glittery. Yeah. Okay. So Ooh. yeah. Ooh. So this costume. Uh, first of all, all of those are the ruins that you've collected uh, oh. through your many playthroughs. Um, if you manage, you mean to your many playthroughs? Yes, my many playthroughs years ago. <clears throat> if you manage to collect all of them in one go, which is hard as fuck, uh, you get the white costume. And the white costume replenishes its scarf every time you land. So the thing that I'm wearing? Yeah. Cool. So this is basically easy mode. What I mentioned before is that like, ah. if we want to have a really nice easy go of this, then you don't have to go in search of the swimmies every time that you've spent your jump. You get it back every time you land. I'm um. Artemis <laughs> from Sailor Moon. Oh, yeah. because he's a white cat. Yeah, Luna was the black one, Artemis was the white one. I did not draw that connection whatsoever. <laughs> I don't know what I was before. None of them are red. Yeah. So now you're fancy. That's all, like, I kind of yeah. wanted to get your input on if you wanted to, to do it like this with the slight uh, advantage to ease of play, or if you wanted to do it natural and see what it's Did like. Did I just sit down? Yeah, you just sat down. This is my, like, idle screen? Like a little. <laughs> I'm just going to meditate until I decide to move. Okay. There is some... Um, yeah, sit, uh, a mixture of jumping, sitting down, and tweeting and chirping and singing. Oh, is, that's so cool! Yeah. I um, the controller vibrated when I landed. Nice. Um, it's neat. So there, is, yeah. Another thing to know about this game is it's a little bit multiplayer. You can encounter other people who are playing the game at the same time. Really? If they're in the same room that you're in, uh, you can bump into somebody who's also playing. And, you know, you, you can follow each other around for a bit and go through actually a surprising amount of the game together. Or you just, you know, say hello and go on your way. Um, Wind's picking up. It's a very a slightly social kind of game. It's panning oh. by itself. Yeah, you just keep uh, keep steady. Keep at it. Oh. Not gonna keep going. Oh, even the dunes are getting a little bit wavely. Is, is it working? Am it's, I going for... I feel like I'm standing in place, actually. You're, yeah, you're marching in place. It's not going to let you. Ugh. Also, are you kind of noticing with your silhouette here that the cape is all flowing out? You're kind of seeing the shape of your, your little cat body. And it's a little bit ambiguous whether you have arms at all. Yeah, actually. <laughs> now that you mention it. We... Oh. Oh. <laughs> I was kind of hoping to slide all the way down, but like, no, that's not what's happening. Whee! Yeah. Oh, <laughs> good stuff. <laughs> I did that just for you, so you should appreciate it. Yeah, I do appreciate it. All right, so. Okay, now to um, to advance uh, further in the game, I believe you need to be up on top of this big thing in the middle. That, like the one in front of me or this one next to me? Uh, the one next to you. The the one that you went up to rescue all of the, the swimmies. So I need to be back on top of it? Yeah, get back on top of it. How? how I don't remember how I did that. It's just, it's just a spiral. It's a nautilus shell. You can walk up it from one side. Okay. Come on, little fishies. Going up. Oh. I think that they might be little fishies because I'm a cat. Oh, and but then you would be predatory towards them instead of their best friend. Okay. Oh, I could have come up from that way. Yeah. Actually, I think you can actually make it onto the top just by jumping at this point because your scarf is long. Wee. There you go. All right, now. That and that looks like a way forward in to me. The middle. Mm -hmm. What what looks like a way forward? Well, that. That. The biggest uh, the biggest of the ruins. Oh. So if you're in the middle of a crowd of these guys, try jumping. It's like yeah, give yourself a bit of a run up and then um, let them follow you and take off. Hocha. Oh. Wee! Sometimes cool. they. <laughs> I did a somersault. Nicely done. 
sometimes they follow you. Aww. Yeah, that's what it is. Disappoint. Like, every once in a while, they'll actually kind of spiral around you as you fly and then return back to their patrol zone. Okay, now this, uh, this thing over here. Have, uh, I'm interested in these glowy these, pillars here. Yeah. Um, they are. Uh, they will tell you if you've gotten all of the hieroglyphs in the level. Oh, so, so that's why two are lit up because yeah, I got two. Two of them have hieroglyphs oh on them in this level, but the other four are just kind of a decoration. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I've gotten all the hieroglyphs in this level. I believe you have. Yes. So um, what's this thing? Wait, no, no, that's not it either. Ah, oh, shit. Um, it's those in front of the statue tell you if you've collected all the hieroglyphs in the level. Those two just the, glow. These three little things? Yeah, these three little things, because you collected three. One way at the beginning and the two in this coliseum kind of area. Oh, right, okay. There were three. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you've got a little statue that kind of looks like you. It also Does it? Kinda, it also kind of looks like an owl. From what angle? What, what do you mean, from what angle? From what angle does it look like me? Okay, turn back around. Turn turn the camera. Have a, a look around here. Let's uh, down the face. That really looks like an owl now. Uh, but, it's uh, panning by itself. Yeah, so it's got little little feeties yeah, and no, a big I billy cape. And then it, it's still panning yeah, by that's itself. That's happening. Um, okay, so now, I, sit. I see... Sit in front of it. Sit in front of it? Yeah, sit in front of it. How do you sit? Um, you can do it on purpose. I forget. I'm that. sure you can. Okay, let me, um, do you want me to kind of figure out what button that is? Sure. All right, here, hang on a second. Uh, uh, good, God damn, the controls are floaty. Um, so it's not just me then? Not really, no. <laughs> um, okay, that is a, no. that's a jump. That is also jump. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Which one of these buttons isn't jump? None. Um, All of them are jump. Okay. All the time. What is that? Oh! Ah, yeah. You can sing! Oh, right. Okay, no, that's, what, that's what how you do happened? it. What just happened? No, I sang to light up all the pillars, and then you just kind of automatically went to the middle and sat down. I've got an Eva face. I look like Eve! <laughs> From Wally. -E. From Wally, -E. yeah. yeah. Okay, now he's gonna he's gonna tell you the story. Ooh, make some popcorn. You've got to <laughs> story time. Yeah, you got uh, all the lovely hieroglyphs and letters and pajamas here. All great wildlife, lots of corn. Uh, is that corn? I, I think it's corn or it's ferns. I don't know mm. if these... Uh, and and the tall, standy-uppy people. And there's cat people and, bent yeah, over. And they're f fascinated by the wigglers. Oh. Yes. It's very 8-bit uh, in here. Yeah. Yeah. Um, very... It's like a little bit kind of Mayan, South American kind of feel to some of the graphics. Hmm. Um, so what did I just see? These statues, um, I, I think lore-wise, what's expected is uh, you're kind of talking to the spirits of the people who used to live in this civilization, and they're telling you the history of their world. Was I not one of them? See, that's left up in the air. Oh my god, you're right, it is an owl. There's a face. <laughs> I just, yeah, just no. saw it. <laughs> it's painting by itself, but like okay. face. Okay, there's a tiny little detail. And that's a wing. Yeah. No, see, he looks like he's, he's, uh, he's a big triangular owl friend. I'm not touching the controls. That's that's okay. Um, you. Just, this is weird to me. Okay, oh, I've sat. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Well, now you're... Um, able to proceed if you would like to, or you can explore a little bit no, more. No, but you need to tell me from what angle it looks like a cat person. What, you? Yeah, no. The, that doesn't look like a cat person. This looks like an owl. But it also kind of looks like you, because it's got the white pajamas, and you've got the little spiky triangles, oh. and it's just a big cape with I'm a little face. I'm an owl? Um, Great, I'm you're, an idiot. You're an owl cat. <laughs> That's... 
a lot of our audience isn't going to understand that connection. That's okay. Okay. <laughs> Fine. This, uh, you heard it here first, folks. Uh, fuck him. <laughs> Rain's an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, and uh, right up the stage. Well, I mean, the the people in the audience that speak Urdu or Hindi will understand it. Will understand it. the <laughs> connotation of owls being stupid. Yeah. Instead of wise and learned, who, who the hell is that? And Pakistani owls are apparently stupid. Who's that? What? Oh, you missed who's, him. Who's where? He was way at the end of the doorway. So there's there's actually one of you, another creature like you, way at the end of the hall. And Can I see him? No, uh, not anymore. Oh. Uh, I'll show you when we cycle the video back around and I'm editing and all that. But basically, the trigger is right here for him to piss off down the hallway. Oh. Um, he well, was that's sad. Way, way at the end. And that's our episode. So we're going to see you next time uh, for an episode of more shenanigans. Woo! Woo! Stay crunchy, even in milk. And we'll see you for another episode of Dracula's. Bye!